hi you guys and welcome back to my channel it is december already i can't i can't even believe it i have not uh, updated about our debt-free journey for a couple of months but do not fear we have not fallen off we have still been attacking our debt and i hope you have as well so i'm just gonna get into it and review how it's been going for us so i'm going to kind of wrap up um, October and November in this video um, so let's see in the month of October we were able to put $1,019.60 toward our debt and in the month of November um, we were able to put $1,273.75 toward our debt. So, um, yeah, we've been trucking along. So we started out, when we first started in July, our total debt was $45,060.55. And coming into the month of December, we are now down to... $36,904.13. So we have paid um, over $8,000 so far onto our debts. And that's really exciting um, considering it's been four months. Um, so we started in July, August, September. Four months. In four months, we've been able to knock out $8,000, um, over $8,000 worth of debt. And that's so awesome, you guys. I'm so excited. Um, I'm really proud of the progress that we've made. I'm steering away from the fact like, okay, I want to be further sooner. But um, even looking back and repeating the numbers to myself about where we started and where we are right now, um, for us, a family of five, um, to be able to put 8,000 like <laughs> extra dollars um, out of necessities like bills and, and rent and all of the stuff that we have to pay to keep the lights on and the heat on and food on our table, to be able to pay eight thousand over eight thousand dollars in four months um, for us is is huge, and it I have to remind myself like this is an accomplishment, and if we keep trucking along like this, we're gonna get um, where we need to go, and it's amazing how um, for us in our family when we decided to do this and be disciplined with our finances and the money that has been coming in there have been so many opportunities that have opened up for for me um, to earn extra income. <clears throat> um, so I do um, photography on the side. Um, I have been watching other children. Um, I've been just doing whatever I can just to bring that extra income in and the opportunities are growing and um, I'm just really excited going forward. We're going to be able to make um, in the, the the next year, um, in the coming year, 2019, we're going to be able to make even more progress um, each month than we thought we were going to make. And so that's really exciting. And so I, I really believe that there is... Um, power and discipline and once you become disciplined and um in an area of your life it not only spills into other areas but it creates amazing opportunities um once you are focused and disciplined and so anyway i'm just really excited so in the last video i showed you guys this um that we are tracking to um track our car payments which is the debt that we are currently paying off you guys look at this we are over the halfway mark which is about here so we are almost there more than halfway done i'm so excited um we have about 
five thousand dollars left on the the car and our goal is to get that paid off by march um so that is the goal that's what we're pressing to to get the car paid off by march and we will i'll let you know well of course i'll keep you guys updated to see if we reach that goal um which i'm i'm pretty sure we will so um yeah you guys that is the update um i think the hardest thing about these last few months as far as the debt journey is um okay i know definitely the hardest thing one of the hardest things for me is my addiction to uh, french fries <laughs> so I, I love buying french fries so it's really um a discipline to drive past and i only get it from them from burgerville usually so i like drive past burgerville like nope we do not even if we have money in the family fun i'm like nope we don't need to waste it on french fries anyway but um more seriously um was this past thursday or not this past thursday but um the black friday deals and and stuff like that so we have money we have money set aside in our budget and i'll be making a budget video as well so we have money that we've been setting aside for christmas but just like so many deals in like the in like getting stuff that we like i don't need but it's like it's but it's on sale um like years past i would have just been like oh i'll let's get it on the credit card and you know we'll pay it off but um since july we have not used our credit card not even once um and so uh yeah that was kind of a struggle because it's like oh i need this oh i need this old navy's having these kind of sales i need that and so that was kind of a struggle this month to stay on track like no we're not gonna go crazy with the black friday deals and so but I did good. I stayed strong, but that was really hard not to to stay disciplined during that season. So, I think those were <laughs> the most difficult times. And then also, I told you about the opportunities that are coming up for me to earn more, you know, like extra income. And so the the um like just wanting to let okay so since this is extra i can just you know spend it on whatever but the being disciplined in okay this is extra money yes but it's going to get us to our goal faster and so just being like okay no this is going toward the debt um and so i think that is challenging as well having extra money um on top of um the income that that you ex expect and just being like no i'm not going to spend this on whatever i want i'm going to put that towards debt so that those have been kind of the challenges i'm sorry you guys if you hear snoring um my husband is laying on the couch and he's snoring and i i asked him to go to the room but he will not anyway um so those were the biggest challenges for me this um in the previous months um so yeah you guys um i been getting some messages saying that um you guys are also on your debt journey and i'm so excited that we can kind of go through this and check in together. Um, leave me more comments. I wanna know where you are in your journey, um, how it's going for you, what are some challenges that you're dealing with as far as your journey. And let's hold each other accountable. Let's encourage each other because it can get tough sometimes, especially during the holidays where there's so much spending going on. There's so much 
so many commercials. Uh, the whole thing about consumerism, spin, spin, spin is what our society is telling us. Um, it can be really, really difficult to really buckle down and um, continue on the debt journey, but we can do it. Um, we see our end goal um, in mind, and I just want to encourage you guys to keep pressing forward, keep working toward your goal. Just whatever the why reason is that you are getting out of debt, keep that in mind, and um, let's let's keep going. Let's get it done. So I want to wish you guys a happy holiday, and I will be coming back with another debt-free journey update in January. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.